Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are previewing the Bundesliga match day 10 match of the week between Bayer Leverkusen and VfL Wolfsburg. We'll be at the Bayer Arena, the home of Bayer Leverkusen for this one. It features on the virtual patch that I use, so we have it for you here in the preview. It's a beautiful stadium and a beautiful rendition. Or maybe I should say beautiful likeness more so than a beautiful rendition. Sounds more like a Maybe say about a cover song. Anyway, here's a look at the Bayer Arena, home of Bayer Leverkusen. Two big clubs in the Bundesliga. Wolfsburg in the Champions League, Leverkusen in the Europa League. Both in European competition, strong sides in the Bundesliga. This matchup is a good one. It's Corio for Fire Lever Fusion. Alright, as the players prepare for kickoff, let's take a look at our starting lineups. For the home side, Bayer Leverkusen, they line up in a four. I call it 4 3 3. Do you pull a 2 3? Patrick Schick. Goal of the tournament, the Euros, the striker. Radeski, finish keeper in net. The VFL Wolfsburg is a 4 2 3 1. The Dutchman, Vekhorst, at the top. The Captain Arnold in the middle. Brooks, the American, and Babu, the Swiss national, on the back line. Big matchup in the Bundesliga. Should be a fun one to watch. Looks like everyone's ready. There's our Derby Star Bundesliga ball. Let's get underway. Patrick Schick kicks us off. Czech National had the goal of the tournament against Scotland in the Euros this summer. I'm sure all the Scotland supporters would prefer if I didn't start every Leverkusen. Every preview Leverkusen or the Czech Republic are involved in with that statement, but I still seem to do it. I was watching that as it happened. I was working from home that day. Games up in the background. And my goodness, what an amazing home that was. Months ago, and I still can't forget it. About three months ago at this point. Still can't forget it. Over three months ago. Over four months ago. What a goal, what a tournament that was. Patrick Schick, for most of us he was already on the map, for anyone for whom he wasn't, he got on him in that tournament. Mercalo to Stefan, he's looking for Vegaborg, but the pass is knocked away. Back in. It's a goal for Byron Leverkusen. Works. Byron. Byron. streak of not playing very well when I play with Wolfsburg. I'm not sure what it is. All I can do is continue to apologize to the Wolfsburg faithful. I know I've got a few who follow my channel. I don't know what it is. Every time I play with Wolfsburg, I seem to not play very well. A lot of draws and defeats I shouldn't have. I don't know what it is. But, uh, this is a pretty even matchup, and particularly at the Bay Arena. I wouldn't be surprised if Bayer Leverkusen took this one, but my goodness, they potentially, I guess it's, it's still early, let's say that, potentially another, another underwhelming performance by me when I play in the Wolfsburgs, Nick Morris, the header's way too far out to trouble Rineski. I 
Rice was born in Poland, but grew up in Finland and was a naturalized citizen there and represented the Finnish side wonderfully in the uh, Euro this summer, which, again, four, four and a half months after it started, I can't stop talking about it. Looks like the rain has started to fall in Leverkusen. I didn't catch when it started unless it was just now, but one of the many things I like about the game and the patch in particular from Virtual Red is the dynamic weather. It can go from day to night, you know, first half light, second half dark, you get rain, or sometimes snow. You know, it kind of starts, it's not just the whole game on or off, which you know, you get that in real life, of course. So. Our dynamic weather is a really nice, authentic little touch. I think what'd be cool is if they had weather report at the beginning that said, like, hey, by halftime, rain should be here. Anyway, as for this one, it's 1 0 Leverkusen at the break. So, a little more possession for Leverkusen. Otherwise, a pretty equal first half, other than the goal, in terms of all your possession stats. challenge gets a little greater here with what looks to be some pretty hard rain. Weather tends to be the great equalizer in terms of attack. Now it seems like we've got some pretty uh, pretty heavy rain here. Uh, that certainly favors Bayer Leverkusen. We already have a lead. We're already playing at home, so I've got the odds are stacked against me here, but I'm hoping I can at least pick a goal somewhere and get a draw here for the Wolfsburg faithful who may be watching. I feel like I've underperformed their club so many times. I really just don't have any explanation for it. This big horse is an unbelievable striker. I just can't get it up there. <laughs> the America and this pass is intercepted. Looking for Patrick Schick. Brooks comes away with it. Off to the Babu, the Swiss fullback. Arnold again in midfield. Bracalo to Veghorst. Trying to speed around there, but maybe not his forte. Seems I'm going to let my contingent of Wolfsburg supporters down again. Not sure what it is. Goodness, I never seem to get the get the win with this side. Goodness, I'll have to apologize for sake of this preview. It's one nil. Bayer Leverkusen. The goal from Burks. Here's the difference. Let's take a look at our highlights. The rain certainly didn't help. Once I got myself down. 
26th minute. Tapsoba sends it in. Verts finds a little sliver of light, sticks it in the near post. Tapsoba gets his boot shined for the service. Starts coming down. Veghorst here. This is probably the best opportunity I have. But certainly, lashes are pretty good, but Rodeski knocks it away, and that's it from the Buy Arena in Leverkusen. It's Fire Leverkusen 1. Via Phil Holzberg Nil. If you enjoy the video, please give it a like. If there's a fixture you'd like to see me play, you can leave it in the comments. If you enjoy this type of content, please subscribe to my channel for more. Again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.